So first of all, we're starting with primer. I'm using the Bioderma Hydrobeal that I'm using for the past one and something year. It's like the best primer, moisturizer, SPF, everything. Also, don't mind the lighting. Uh, it's almost nighttime, so my half a is natural light, and my other half a is, is this yellow hideous light, but anyways. Then we're going into corrector. I'm using the Bobby Brown in light bisque. It's like, I uh, guess, like the best high-end uh, correcting peachy color thing. It's amazing. Buffing it out with the Beauty Blender. Also watching 21 Keys. So <laughs> I'll be watching, um, but I'll be turning my head. Then we're going in with combo of Tushy Club and Naked Skin in light. Mixing these two together. To have the perfect color for my face because I'm a little bit of tan. Yeah, this is me, tan, imagine. Then we're going in, blending it, applying it throughout the face, creating an even base. Then with Derma Blend, we're gonna we're gonna go and conceal the pimples, acne time. And some glasses, um, glasses mark. Buffing that out. Then we're gonna use the Mac Paint Pot um, to contour, cream contour our face. Mud brush underneath the cheekbones, the holes of the cheek. Underneath the down lip and onto our nose. Onto our forehead and Blending, blending, blending. The Beauty Blender is just amazing, seriously. I've used also the Sephora ones, but I didn't like them. Beauty Blender all the way. Naked Skin Concealer in Light. Also blending yeah, the point of when you use like anything creamy and powdery. Anyway, uh, yeah, the point is when you use products to blend them so you have like a more natural effect. Forehead, bridge of the nose, the T zone, yeah. Primer for the eyes, shadow insurance by Too Faced. My MAC palette, I have also some quads, but yes, yeah, this is the main MAC palette. Securing our primer. Then first we're going to go into our crease to just give a little bit of definition. And onto our other eye. Blending, blending, blending. The key to makeup. Again, onto our crease to give a little bit of like more definition, creating an outer V. Coming in. 
to give a little bit of like more depth. Benefit palette. Or you can use like any color. You can use mattes, you can use like bronzy colors, anything. It's like you, you, you do you. Golden color. Highlighting our inner corner of the eye just to give like a little pop and under the brow bone. So this is for the eyes, off to a little bit of baking using Laura Mercier translucent loose powder. This stuff like it's amazing. Yeah, it's pricey, but it's so amazing. After five or six, seven minutes, we're taking it off. A little bit of like powder or also, also Laura Mercier. This time the pressed powder. Watching series, classic. <laughs> this is me and the Bobby Brown uh, natural bronzer. Onto the hollows as we did before. Under our lip and onto the nose. Basically, we repeat the steps we did before. You can use either uh, cream products or or powder products but I'm like I like to use like both just to be certain and also this take like four hours blend 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 like there's no tomorrow yeah this glass is hard it's never going away and a little bit of bronzer onto our forehead and on, under our face just to define our face a little bit like more blend again and using the blush uh, mask in crease And also the sugar bomb uh, blush from Benefit. Then off to highlight up Mary Luminizer by the Paul. Taking it a little bit like uh, in the corner of the eye for these like uh, summer glow. 
frigid vanilla and cupid's bow then doing the zombie and lining our eyes don't try to line your eyes um, simultaneously looking um, for the mirror and a camera like it's disastrous not my best line of work but to our other eye Brassing this we are brows Singing also and going in to fill them, creating a downline and an upline, a corner, and filling them in. We're gonna set them with the benefit also uh, setting creamy, yeah, and priming our lashes using the S Loda lashes primer, yeah. And after that, we're gonna use the Smashbox Full Exposure Mascara. From the roots of the eye onto the lips, which is the final step. 17 liner. I'm a little bit overlining my upper lip because it's like um, so close my down lip, and I want them to like be kind of even. And a uh, Givenchy lipstick. The packaging of this thing is heavy, but it's amazing. And setting everything with the um, body soap, chamomile. Yeah, this is the finished look. I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you soon.